Right. All right, guys. So we're here with Sawyer Martin. Sawyer's gonna show us his 2021 what's in the bag setup. Already played a couple tournaments. Already played a couple rounds with me, and I've uh, I've been on the bag caddy for him a little bit, so we know all about it. Sawyer's game's definitely improved a lot, and a lot of it has to do with these these clubs and these changes you've made, right, Sawyer? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So we'll start with the wedges. Um, everybody loves my weird wedge setup. Yeah. So in the 60 through 52. I have tailor-made wedges, so one's a high toe and the other two are MG2s, all custom stamped. Yeah, we, we see you have your initials on there, the SM for Sawyer Martin. Uh, they usually all have the KBS S-Taper 120s, but yep. the 60 had a bit of a accident. <laughs> so we, we lost that guy. Uh, yeah. So the bounce on those, my 52 is nine degrees of bounce, my 56 is 12 degrees of bounce, my 60 is 10 degrees of bounce. Yeah. The 60 will not be here for much longer. I just ordered another one. Yeah. So for my pitching wedge, I have a 46 degree Titleist SM7. This hasn't changed. Dynamic Gold 2 SU X100. Uh, multi compound grips on all my clubs except for the 60 because we had the slight incident. Yeah, slight, slight, slight breakage there. And so that 46 is bent to 48 just to fix gapping and yep. whatnot. So okay. sounds good. Now moving into the irons, what do we have here? So I still have my 620 CVs with the X100 shafts. These, I don't really know how much longer they'll be in the bag. Yeah. I mean, so my whole thing with them, I don't get any forgiveness from them. Yeah. And I can't work them as much as a blade, so I'd rather play a blade that I can work more. And I, forgiveness isn't really an issue. Yeah. It's just the whole point of I can't work them as much as I want to. So yeah. I and you have those in better. nine to four iron, right? Yeah, nine to four iron. Okay, sounds good. Bumped it up to three iron. I have a P760 tailor made. Ooh, that's clean. Uh, two or shoe X100 multi compound. This is all my irons are degree flat, but this is this is degree flat and it's bent a little strong. Okay. So it's more like a two iron ish. It goes about 260 in the air. So wow. it does its job. It's also a little bit, it's, I think it's a half inch longer. Okay. Just to play more like a driving iron instead of an iron. Yeah. So this is kind of my fairway finder club, get it yeah. in the fairway when I need. And let's let's check out these sick head covers we have here. So obviously we have your nice logo, the SM, uh, kind of blended together on one letter for Sawyer Martin. We have the uh, the black and red has spotted on the three wood. Let's see this three wood here and then we'll move on to the driver. So in the three wood, I'm playing TaylorMade Sim 2, cranked to lower. Yeah. Uh, I got a DI or an IZ uh, graphite design, an X-Flex. It's tipped a little bit. And so the reason I play this at lower is just, so the lower the loft, the more open it sits. I hate seeing the ball go left as the camera well knows. <laughs> so this is a half inch short, um, just to kind of uh, get it in the fairway club for me. It's yep. done its job, it goes off the deck, I can hit it into par five is about 280 and I can then off the tee is about 300. So. Wow. It's a good, so that's not bad. Yeah, good beater club. Just yep. get me in the fairway when yeah. I need it. That was our, uh, in our tournament, I just caddied for you. That, that was our old reliable club. So if we were struggling with the driver or something, we went back to that and sure enough, put us right in the fairway. Struggling with the driver. Yep. So let, let's see what we got here. Are we anticipating any changes with this or are you pretty satisfied with the nah, driver? This three wood and driver are going to be here for a while. Okay. So, Taylor made Sim 2, eight degrees, playing at six. Wow. Um, I launched the ball extremely high, which the camera knows. <laughs> so in that, we Lots got of spin. same shaft. We got the graphite design, IZ6, X-Lex. Yeah. It's tipped about an inch and a half just to really knock down spin, and it plays at six. So ball doesn't like to get up and spin that much, which I really like because yep. spin sucks. Yeah. So yeah, this, uh, I'm working on some getting some PR ball speeds, so. Yep, personal record ball speeds. All right, now let's move on to this putter. So as you can see, we just celebrated the 4th of July yesterday. Hope everyone had a safe, a safe and uh, happy holiday. So we have the uh, American flag, American design, sweet putter head cover, and that's covering up the, what do we have here, Sawyer? I have a tailor-made uh, TP Juno long neck. Mm -hmm. So I've been, Everybody knows about my putting issues. I switch putters quite a lot. This has actually been in the bag for probably longer than most of my putters. Really? Because I putt the best with it. So how long have you had this in the back in the bag for? A couple weeks? A couple weeks. <laughs> uh, it's been in since right just after Christmas. I ordered it right around Christmas. Got it a couple months later, or yeah. a couple weeks later, and it's been in the bag ever since. Yeah. 
Uh, it's 33 and a half inches. Got a super stroke flat toe grip just to help me with putting. Yeah. And yeah, it's a pretty sweet setup. I really like it. I don't see this going out of the bag anytime soon. Yeah, Sawyer so. speaks very highly of those uh, super stroke flat toe grips. Yeah, Regan should get one on his putter. I should, I really should. On his new putter nonetheless. Oh yeah, what's in the bag for Reg coming soon. So we've gone over our club, Sawyer. Now we're gonna move into the actual bags. As we can see, you're rocking the uh, Row Golf special design Nike bag with the Row logo and your name on it right there. It's pretty sick. Yeah, so what do we got here as the range finder? Uh, so the cap fell off, but it is a Bushnell Tour V5. Okay. Uh, this thing has been beat pretty well. Yeah. Uh, it does its job. It's magnetic, so it sticks on things. It's pretty cool. Wow. I like it. It does its job. It's a range finder. Yep. So, Nothing super special there, but gotta do what you gotta do, right? Yep. So this year I'm playing the 2021 TP5Xs. Yep. And why do you like these balls? Um, well, I like the 2019 a little bit more. They're just harder to find. These spin gotcha. a little bit more and are a bit softer, which I don't like. But okay. They're still the same kind of thing, TP5. They yep. Or TP5X, they spin a little bit less than TP5, so they okay. do their job. Respect it. And then anything else special in your back here? Uh, my gloves, I use the TaylorMade TP series. That's about it. Yep. Oh, yeah. Let's see these yardages here. So, obviously, we got Sawyer's so Juggernaut username, 60 goes, 85, 90, 56, 105, 110. And then you can just kind of see the rest of these here and like, how they all play out. And these are on my carry numbers. Dri so. Driver goes large. That was Rob's idea, not mine. <laughs> so, that's, that's about it here for Sawyer. We went over all your clubs. You have 14 in total clubs? Yes, sir. All right, 14 clubs, went over the ball, went over the range finder, went over the glove, and uh, that's sort of your setup for this 2021 year. Hopefully it uh, brings him some success, and we'll see him on the channel pretty soon. Isn't that right, Sawyer? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, bro. Thanks for taking the time to do this. Good luck this year. Thank you.